guys, it's me Kayla and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be doing a no budget Halloween shopping spree at Learning Express. I am so excited you guys. I am actually at Learning Express right now. You could probably kind of see the sign behind me and I'm like, oh my gosh, I'm like out of breath because I am so excited. I am pretty much 100% sure they have all of their Halloween inventory out and I could not be more pumped. I'm literally wearing a jack-o'-lantern t-shirt right now and I was listening to Spooky Scary Skeletons on the way here. Insert footage now. Yeah, so I also have this like Halloween looking monster. I mean, this isn't like limited edition or anything, but look, it's just a vibe. It's a vibe. And wait, oh my gosh, it's literally called a monster, like <sighs> monster for Halloween. If you couldn't tell, I'm really excited and I have to pee a little bit, but sometimes I work better when I have to pee just like a little bit because it kind of keeps me on my toes, if you know what I'm saying. But guys, before we get into this video, I have a challenge for all of you watching. So I want to see if you can like, click subscribe, and turn on post notifications in just five seconds. So are you guys ready for the countdown? Because here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. Time's up. If you guys were able to successfully complete the challenge, then I want you to spam the comment section with as many Halloween emojis as your little heart desires. So anyways, you guys, without further ado, we are going to head into Learning Express right now, and we're just gonna get all the Halloween fidgets, and I'm so excited. So let's go. P.S. you guys, I am planning to follow up with a super awesome haul, so stay tuned for that, but let's go inside now. So guys, I just got into the store and oh my gosh, they have an entire shelf of Halloween fidgets and slime. So I'm going to get one of everything. So first of all, look at all of these slimes. They all look so tempting. So they have, oh, this is so creative. Boo to cream frosting instead of buttercream frosting. That is adorable. So I'm pretty sure these are scented. Yeah, I have two dope slimes at home and they smell really good. So we are going to add this to our basket. Then we have oh, candy corn frosting. Oh, girl, this looks amazing. Oh my gosh, like look at the colors. I bet this smells like heaven on earth. So we're getting this as well. And then cookies, or no, <laughs> I said <laughs> I said cookies and scream. I'm just embarrassing myself now. No, cookies and scream. Get it? Like cookies and ah, scream. These are so creative. Uh, oh my gosh. And this is like a, it's like a black and white slime. I'm very like, I don't know if anyone else is this way, but I'm always very particular about like picking the most perfect looking one. Like if the label is slightly off centered, I'm like, uh, no, we gotta get a different one. So we're gonna go with this one cause it looks the most perfect to me. All right, so we already have three slimes. Oh my gosh, guys, <gasps> look at this. They have a little mini candy corn poppet. This is probably the cutest thing I've ever seen in my entire life. We're gonna get this one because I picked it up first and I don't wanna put it back because I'd feel sorry for it. So we're gonna add that to the basket. Then, okay, if you thought that was amazing, they have more. There's more where that came from. So I never know what to call these. Um, they say Mega Pop keychains. So I guess that's what we're gonna call them. Um, like I used to call them poppets and I used to call them simple dimples, but. We're just gonna go with the name that's on the packaging. So they have this cute little pumpkin, which we're going to add to the basket. We have candy corn, also going into the basket. A little ghost, oh my gosh, it even has like a little face. Do you guys see that? He's so cute. All right, and then this is like a rainbow ghost. Then we have even more mini poppets. Like, are you kidding me right now? This is almost too good to be true. So we have this candy corn one. It's very, very vibrant. So we're gonna add that to our basket. Oh my gosh, wait, how cool is this? So it's like a little candy corn bear. I did not expect that. And then, ooh, I don't know what this is supposed to be. It's kind of like a Halloween Frappuccino poppet, um, but I guess it could be really any drink you want. So we're gonna say it's a pumpkin spice latte fidget from Starbucks, okay? Um, look at that halloween colors so cute we're gonna get this as well and then oh right next to each other they have two halloween cupcakes so guys do you think i should get the one with the green frosting and the orange cake or the orange frosting with the purple cake 
comment below and let me know because I'm going to do one or the other. Um, I don't know. I feel like I'm vibing more with this one. So let me know your thoughts. Okay. I feel like we went through this so quickly, but they also have some of these little spider poppets at the bottom here. These are so cool and creepy all in one. So we have this one with like black and yellow. It's like tie dye. That's really cool. And then we also have this all black one. This one almost looks too real. It's kind of freaking me out. So we're gonna add that one to the basket as well. And then the last one they have is like red and black. This one gives me like Spider-Man vibes. So comment below which one you would want the most out of these three. So we're gonna get the whole gang. That is the entire fidget and slime section that they have for Halloween. I'm not sure if they're getting more in or not, but this is pretty awesome, you guys. Like, I am beyond excited to try these out. Just for fun, we're gonna do a little sweep around the store to see what else they have. And you never know, there might be some little hidden gems. Um, you never know, you never know. So let's look around and see what we could find. So here's their poppet section. It looks like they do have some new ones. So before they only had the soccer ball, but now they also have a basketball a football and a baseball. So those are really cool. I love the way they look all together. Oh wait, look how cute this avocado is. <gasps> I've never seen this color green before on a poppet. It's so pretty. Okay, this is literally calling my name. I wish, <laughs> I wish somehow I could make this into a Halloween fidget. Like how can avocados be related to Halloween? Cause I need an excuse to buy this. Just saying. For back to school, they have these poppet pencil cases. These are so unique. I feel like if I would have had one of these when I was in school, I would have literally been popping the bubbles all day long. <laughs> It'd be very hard to resist. Guys, they are totally sold out of their Halloween Squishmallows. They come and go very, very quickly. We still have some super cute ones out right now though. Next time they are in stock, you better believe I am going to be stocking up big time. So it looks like they definitely restocked their PBJs, which is giving me life because I love these so much. The last time I was here, they only had the monsters really, but these are brand new. They're a little bit smaller than the original ones. 10 seconds later. Okay, so funny story. I was over there looking at the PBJs and I see a suspicious substance on the floor and then I smell poop. I guess somebody had an accident. Um, so they're cleaning that up right now. I said, honestly, they were probably just so overwhelmed and excited about the fact that there were new PBJs out that, you know, they just let a little turd out. <laughs> so they're taking care of business right now. We're going to go back over there, but... I don't know. I think it's funny. I'm like, I hate to be the one to tell you this, but I think someone had an accident over there. Look at that. Taking care of business. Oh, wait. I smell it. You, I knew it. I know. I was over there. I'm like, I smell I something right. Smell <laughs> so I love it. No, no. Wait. Okay. This is kind of funny. They took inspiration from this fidget right oh, here. Yeah. <laughs> the pooping. <laughs> like, oh, I can do that too. <laughs> So guys, do you think that this should qualify for a Halloween fidget? I don't know, because like the green and the purple, it's giving me Halloween vibes. Then there's blue, so I don't know. I'm thinking about maybe getting like this green one. What do you guys think? Is that cutting it close? Should it qualify? Yes or no? I think it's kind of like a maybe item, so I'm going to hang on to it. Okay, let's see what else do they have. They also have Twiddle Cubes which are really fun, but I have so many in my collection already. So we're just gonna leave those there for now. They have the giant DNA balls, giving me Halloween vibes. I mean, look at it, orange, purple, and green. I would get it, but I already have one. Then we have, ooh, okay, so these would honestly be kind of fun for Halloween. I have this in my, literally in my car. It's like a piece of, a block of cheese with mice. So that's really fun. And then we have these frogs. Oh my gosh, these feel so neat. They have orange, they have green, they have red. Again, super on the fence. Should this qualify or not? I mean, I guess if you really thought hard enough, you can make any one of these things a Halloween fidget. Oh wait, look, look, it's laying eggs. I didn't know it did that. I thought it was just a squishy texture. Okay, that's pretty funny. We've got some noodles. 
color changing needles and then these um shaggy needles as well so guys i was just looking at these pbjs and you will never believe it but i found one that is perfect for this challenge it's a little black bat or no it's a spider oh my gosh it has legs not wings duh look at this oh my gosh this is for sure coming home with us let's see if we can make it in the basket ready Perfect, yes. And then there's this little snail. Yes, orange packaging, but it's not Halloween, so we'll have to pass. They also have this little orange goldfish, which is super cute. Um, what's this? Oh, it's a little, okay, so these are really neat. They have these keychain style PBJs now. So that's something brand new. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna have to come back here and snatch some of these when I'm not doing a Halloween shopping challenge, because these are more like summery but they're still super duper cute. But I think that that was the only Halloween one. Oh wait, actually, no, I'm totally wrong. These monsters are definitely perfect for Halloween. Where is my brain right now? I don't know. But yeah, monsters and Halloween are perfect. What does this say? Hang on, collect them. Oh, Booger, wait, do they have names? Yeah, apparently his name is Booger. What the heck? Oh my gosh, we're gonna take Booger home with us. And then what's her name? It's Shrikwoops, I, I don't know, but okay she's pretty cool too let's find one with a perfect face you know me so we're gonna get her too and then what's his name it should be sully <laughs> like from monsters inc um his name is cyclopes okay all right he's pretty cool we'll get him too and then the last one did we get all of them no we have one more to get it's this purple one whoa she looks like she had a long night no this is me <laughs> after i get like an hour of sleep and then i have to film the next day so i just like load up the mascara and wish for a miracle to happen that i'll be able to function normally um that's actually what i look like anyway um so her name is ozzy yay she has a normal name easy to pronounce so we're gonna get ozzy too bada boom so i was just looking at these zippers and look guys they have a purple and orange one which is definitely giving me Halloween vibes. So we are definitely going to add this to the basket. I successfully went around the entire store to make sure I didn't miss out on anything. And look at this. We have a pretty nice stash going on. I am going to check out and then I'm going to be following up with a huge haul. So definitely stay tuned for that. I'm going to go check out. I'm going to wait. I'm going to estimate and see if I can guess how much this is going to come to because I've always had this psychic ability to guess the prices of things. I don't know how, but I'm going to show you guys an overview and then we can guess together. So I'm not going to think too much and I am just going to guess that all of this is going to come to $114.91. Okay, that's just wild guess. I have no idea. Might be way more, might be way less, but yeah, $114. Comment below what you guys think it's going to come to, but I'm going to go check out now and then I will update you after I am done. Okay, guys, that was literally so much fun. We found so many amazing Halloween fidgets. I'm so proud. And P.S., um, the grand total, I told you I'm a very good estimator. The grand total was exactly $113, so I was legit a dollar off. I'm going to give myself a pat on the back. I'm pretty excited about that. But, guys, please stay tuned for my next video because I am going to be doing an in-depth haul of everything that I got today. We're going to test out the poppets, the slimes, all of the fun things. But, anyways, you guys that was all for today's video if you enjoyed it then please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and i will talk to you guys soon bye Mwah.